Hello and welcome to Let's Talk SEO. So Google has announced that their Bard AI can now read and understand YouTube videos. And the reason why this is great is because now you can literally create articles based on your research of YouTube videos and you don't even have to watch a dozen YouTube videos to figure out what's going on. So in this video, what I'm going to show you is how to use Google Bard for research and mainly researching YouTube videos using that research and then copying that over to ChatGPT, using ChatGPT to then incorporate that research into articles and then redo those articles into ones that are better written, that, are, that have more read to them, and that will also improve in terms of ranking. So uh, the thing to keep in mind here is that this is still barred in its test phases. So the prompts I show you in this video may not work for you if you're using it a month from now. But this works as of right now, so you might have to rejig the prompts. I'll try to put the, all the prompts in the description of this video. Uh, so let's jump into my screen and I'll show you exactly how to use this to generate great articles. Okay, so this is Google Bard right here. And what we're we, uh, we going to try to do here is to use Google Bard to research YouTube and to write an article, a comprehensive article, which in this case is going to be a pillar article, for a dog training site to build authority. And so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna ask Bard to search YouTube for a video on dog training. So we're gonna go here, please find the best video on dog training. And we're just gonna say this and see what it pulls up. And so you see it's loading YouTube here and it's pulled up at I think it's sort of it's five videos that it's it thinks it are the best ones. Now, if I was really writing this article and it's not for just this example, I would watch these videos. But um, to keep things short and to keep things quick, what I'm going to do here is uh, so that you get the idea of what we're trying to do. We'll just go with the one that's number one over here. And the number one here is five dog training exercises you should do every day at home. Um, and over here, I'll ask Bard, please thermize the five exercises discussed in this video. Please, let's just do please detail. And we'll paste the link. And this is uh, paste the link from here so that it does not need to do a great deal of work. Copy, paste, and see what it comes up with. So it right off the bat, it gives us the five exercises. Now, it's not the way it's presented in the video in the in the sense that it's not exactly the same wordage. So it's taken the wordage, it's surmised it, it's done all of that good stuff. So we don't have to go in and actually watch the video. Uh, with few, if I were really doing this article, I will find more videos like these. And for instance, I would also do the same for this over here and for this over here. And so that I have a comprehensive article, but we're going to look at this. It says threshold manners. And so this is a practice of teaching your dog to sit and wait calmly at the door. And so food drill, uh, crate training. So these are the three, uh, these are the five that were discussed in the video. And so what we're going to do is we're going to take this and we will copy this over into a, so go ahead, we'll copy this over into a Word document. And this is really just where, so we're collecting our thoughts. And so the next part of this is we're going to also look at, so, it's, so this is a few other videos. So one of this was this five dot training exercises. There's another one there, five dot training exercises you can start today. I think these are similar videos, but what I also want to do is the biggest secret. So dot training fundamentals. So I also want to do this fundamentals thing and see what it comes up with. Um, so we'll take this over here. Well, actually we'll just, um, yeah. So we will copy the prompt that we did over here. So here, paste it, we'll remove this from since we're going to do the fundamentals video, uh, I'll copy link. So even though you do copy link, it doesn't copy the link. So there's no, but, but still it's a lot easier discussing this dog training video. So we'll, just so that we have more content to work on. When you're putting this through, through chat GPT, it's going to take a while for chat GPT. You're going to have to also fine tune chat GPT to write the article exactly the way you want it so that it ranks well, that's informative. And so you need to provide it with as much information as possible. 
So it says here, I'm sorry, I'm going to en enable to access the YouTube content. It's possible for a number of reasons. Okay, so this is usually a bug, and we could try this again. Okay, for some reason, this is not working. So we will have to change tact here. So we'll copy the prompt, and we'll try another video. Uh, so this is, since this is still in beta, you know, you are going to encounter problems like these. We're going to use this video over here. We're going to copy the link. And we're going to change tag a little bit. And instead of asking for the fundamental, we'll say, please detail, or please detail all the points discussed in this video. And so it's, for some reason, it it's just refusing to access this video as well. I cannot directly access and analyze YouTube videos to provide summaries or details, however. So maybe it doesn't want to give us a summary. And the reason why I'm showing you all of this is because you might encounter problems like these and then how you overcome them is important. And so we're going to copy our prompt again over here and we try to rejig this so that it works. So this is our prompt. We're going to copy this over here, paste it over here and please detail the points. So we're not going to say outline points. And so we'll see if this works. If this does not work, it means that things have changed a little bit, but okay. So this is working. So the video, everything you need to know about dog covers, the wide range, and now it gives us all of this good stuff. So understanding the dog's mind, and it gives us all of this, the dog's motivation, play, establishing the training plan. You know, so all this entire video, this entire video has been literally outlined for us so that we can use this to write our own article. And so I'll copy this real quick, copy and paste this into the Word document that I showed you. And, and then we'll switch over to ChatGPT. Well, actually I want to paste this before ChatGPT can be a little bit of a stiffler when it comes to issues like these. So we'll take this and this is all the content we have. And now we'll switch over to ChatGPT. And so we'll do a new chat and we'll say, I want you to write a killer article of 2000 words, even though it might not produce 2000 words, we'll probably have to break this down. So maybe 1000 words and it will not even produce 1000 words, even though this is the paid version. It's, um, what are we going to do? Words on and that I paste, that I paste back to you understand what I want. Here is the outline you should follow. I'll say introduction. Why the training is important. And we're gonna take a quick look at our notes over here and how job training works and also do training plans and Let's see, teaching basic commands, probably the split, split screen over here, which is a lot better. I'll split the screen here and you might not be able to see this as well, but I need to split the screen since I need to switch between both these window windows. So addressing common behavioral issues. Um, we also want this over here and we also want additional tips. We wouldn't do that because we're going to use this over here. Um, five out oh, detail. We're also going to do detail to five best dog training exercises and conclusion. We're going to aim for 2000 words. You know, 1000, but let's do 2000 and see. I know it will probably not work, but. Let's try it anyways. So we'll copy over here. It says it understands a prompt and now it's asking me for the text. So I'll copy and paste all of this text over here. Give it to chat GPT and hopefully the output will be good. And in my experience, the and in my experience, the output has been always pretty good from this. And um, because this is not scraping this is not scraping the bottom of the barrel, which is at the websites. You're actually doing the research, but you're pulling in the research from BARD. Uh, so by doing that, you're not really skimping through the whole research process. And this makes the whole content creation system 
a lot easier and also a lot faster if you're using GPT. And it's a lot better than just adding a bunch of prompts and then asking ChatGPT to write your articles. Um, and this turned out to be a, a lot better than what is otherwise produced. Now, you can see from this that it's, you know, this five best dog training techniques, it's just, it's just outline this, just, there's no details. There are no details mentioned over here. There are no details mentioned over here. And so what this is, is mainly, this is the skeleton of the article. We now have to prompt ChatGPT to add more bulk to it. So we're gonna start with this over here and we're gonna ask ChatGPT, can you please detail the five best dog training exercises that you wrote and it should be based on the text we pasted and so hopefully ChatGPT understands this and I, the reason why I use 4.0 is a little more it's a little more it's a little smarter perhaps and it does a better job but even over here you can see you know it's not actually detailing it because if we go to our original over here, sorry. So this is, you can see it's it's adequate information. And so if you look at this over here, it's, okay, so it's 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 done a good job. So it's gone ahead, it's outlined all of this over here real well. It's, uh, let's see if there's any hallucinations here. So the threshold matters and while teaching the dog to sit with calm, how to train, start having your dog on a leash, approach the door, as the dog to sit, and then food drill. So this is the food drill, which is also looks good. Okay, and it's pretty well laid out. And so what I will do is this, if I was doing this article for real, I will paste this into a Word document and then I will paste what was produced over here in place and replace this over here. Then I would ask ChatGP to elaborate on this based on the text we pasted in and also, you know, uh, add more information about why dog training is important because we gave it way more information over here. But this is a pretty doable article. I mean, it's very readable. If you say dog training is an essential aspect of pet ownership, fostering a harmonious respect, so respectful relationship between a dog and its owner, why dog training is important, dog training goes beyond teaching basics commands. It's about understanding and shaping the dog's food. So yeah, so it's very well written. It's, it's informative and it saves you from hours of work. Uh, and you should find the prompts for these in the description. You, you will find it as a pinned comment. Now you know, folks, this is how you can generate great articles based on BARD. Uh, it really cuts resource time by, by a lot, and this will help you generate great quality content uh, for your readers, for your website, for your blog, and that which hopefully ranks very well if you're optimizing correctly using the methods or the steps in this video. Let me know in the comments below uh, what you think of this and if you're going to use this to generate content. Uh, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.